X Design 101 here. I know I told you we were going to do the skills and m monsters, but unfortunately I decided that we need to do this because it's a third person controller, right? And it supports it and it's what it's supposed to do. And I just couldn't leave you guys at what it was. So, part two of the animations is learning how to use blends. But first, look at it. Look at it. Now you can go a little bit. Now you can go completely right and left and backwards. Yeah. See, it look it looks pretty good. Also depends on the animations you have, right? So. Boom. Let's get learning. So, this is what uh, my blend tree currently looks like. But uh, I'm going to make a new uh, one for you guys here. So, uh create animated controller character 2 uh, <clears throat> just gonna quickly add the parameters again well actually I don't know why I even did that I can just delete this just duplicate that for easier purposes Uh, keep that there. Open that. Well, actually, oops. Don't run the blend tree. I want to delete the blend tree. Okay. Now that the blend tree is gone, uh, all we have left is uh, all you want to have left is that uh, attack that we left in here. But as you can see, we have no idle, so the attack became the main thing. So if you were to play the game right now, your guy would just be swinging his attack the whole time. So not a great idea. So right click, create from new blend tree now that we got a blend tree here we're going to double click now we have blend tree and base layer these tabs right here uh, click back on base layer right click we want to uh, set as layer default here because it's our layer default there we go that's all we really need to do right now then double click on your blend tree again <coughs> on your blend tree uh, we are going to click on blend type go to 2d simple directional we want left right and forward yes we want left right and forward now we're gonna want a, mo uh, a couple motions here this is gonna take a one two three so walk and then so walk left right uh, back and one more you have to have two left and rights because you got to reverse the other two kind of or it just won't look right you'll see okay um so click on to your uh, character and find your animations uh mine is more difficult than it was before since it's the blade npc special kit i believe that's what it's called yeah i, I guess it would be Stretch that up and shrink this here. Well, special pack. Okay, whatever. It doesn't matter. Anyway, uh, I ha every animation that I use, since it's because it's a separate animation inside of it, right? Um, I actually have to click on it and then make sure that it's looped. If it's not loop, loop it, and then go into the rig and set it to generic instead of legacy. <coughs> you learn how to do that in the first video. So we're just going to continue straight into finding the animations that we need to fill into here. So we're going to need, uh, uh, well I'm going to need run zero one. So that's our running here. Here's our back, which we'll put here. Where's uh, left? Oh, I need another one here. That motion. It's going to be our uh, attack standby, which is our idle, actually. It just it means he's holding his sword all the time. With Mechanum animations, we could do uh, all kinds of stuff. Like, if we wanted to, we can use the bull, and we could have whether or not he has his sword in or out. And if he has his sword out, we play the animation, take out sword, and then... He's going to hold his sword in his hand from now on, and then 
yeah that is definitely doable I can do that in another tutorial for now we're just setting it up so you can get the fancy walking for your game <coughs> all right so now we need the left and rights totally rambled off there sorry guys it was definitely needed information though uh, run left we need that twice oops crap no. okay that's good there we go <coughs> Sorry, it's very messy. It's how it comes. Anyway, <coughs> now we need to set a few things here. The position. Uh, yeah. It's hard to explain, actually. Um. Alright, so I remember now. We're setting these blue dials right here to the right thing. So if we uh, click play right here, we're walking straight. We want to walk forward and then... Uh, as you can see it's all confused because we're getting into the directions of these but it's not proper so we're gonna press pause here and we're gonna position these so our run needs to be position X 0 and position Y 1 so at the top here then our left would be negative 1 yes and keep it at 0 our run would be 1 our, our right, yeah, my bad. <clears throat> we actually want this to be, uh, yeah, no, we want this to be at uh, zero. Yeah, yeah, we'll just continue. I know what I'm doing. I'll explain when I'm done. Well, a little bit as I go to. So now our back walk is negative one here. But we also need this to be zero because it needs to be walking backwards. <coughs> Our left is actually going to be one this time, and then yeah, zero point five. So I think it needs to be minus zero point five. Oh shit, that's too much. Zero point two. Oh, whoops. Yeah, 0 0.1, that's good. <coughs> and then, um, we need to 0 and 0 our, our attack anim- our idle animation. This is going to be negative 1 and 0 0.1. Oh shit, it should be 0. There we go. It looks like one's a little higher than the other for some reason. Well, I guess it's because it's got to be a negative that would make more sense. There we go, yeah, okay. I solved that. See, so yeah, it needed to be negative. <coughs> so now that this is set up, we press, uh, let's uh, bring this up here. We press play on here. It's uh, playing the animate idle, and we can walk forward. And the, f the more forward we go, and then we can turn. So let's look at it in this angle here. We're turning, go back to forward. And then start reversing in the turning angle. So yeah, we're all set up here. Um, this is what it looks like in there. Back in the base layer, that's literally it. And from uh, from the attack here, you're just going to want to make a transition to the base layer. Add if it's uh, less than 
and put the attack and then we want less than one and we'll leave that at that all right perfect uh, see you guys later next video will definitely be the skills in monster cube take care guys